Hello and welcome to Simply Solo Playthroughs. I'm the Chipmunk Gamer and I'm here with one of the games that's on my 30 under 30 list and that is One Card Dungeon. Now what makes this special is this is a retheme. This is part of my high quality games for print and play that can be done inexpensively. This sheet cost me one dollar to print 50 cents per side at my local library and yes i went and printed it at my my local library just to make sure and you can go on ahead and bring your own dice you can go on ahead and play and you get a really great game in one card dungeon there's a link below in the comments so make sure that you like and subscribe and let's take a look and join me at the table <music> Okay, thank you for joining me at the table. We're all set up with one card dungeon. And we're going to go on ahead and roll our energy dice. Now, we have a 446. By the way, I do not have a character card. There are plenty of character cards that you can download. And there's all kinds of stuff. But I went for inexpensive here. So, here we go. We're going to go on ahead and... Move two, four, it costs two to move this way, costs three to move diagonally. So that's all we're going to get here. They're both going to move five and three and two. They cannot hit me. So I will go on ahead and, and yeah, they can't hit me. Okay, this guy will take one damage. And we're going to move two. No, we're gonna move here to, for two. Okay, they will both close in and move two points each. They attack for 10, I have a defense of seven, so I take one damage. Oh, nice. 466. Six. This one is out. I am just going to move to right here. It's going to try and attack with a 4 and cannot break my shield at 445. Four, Takes one damage. Can't do anything to me. And that's the end of our. Nope, oh, all I need is a three. And he's out. So it's a pretty simple game in that you just keep moving through the dungeon and it keeps changing. We're at five. And when you come to a new level, what you can do, there's three points of damage you can either heal or you can increase your defense. In this case, I'm going to increase my defense by one or I'll increase one of your energy, one of your dice. Uh, this one's kind of nice because this lets you hit diagonally rather than just orthogonally. So we're gonna go on ahead and just leave these as it is. We're gonna keep the two. We're gonna go on ahead and move and we're not gonna do anything. We're just gonna sit. They have a movement of four, two, four, two, four, two, four. There we go. One, four, five. So we can easily hit. But we are going to move here. 
they're gonna move two and four and two and four. He'll hit, but he'll strike, but cannot hit me. Two, four, five. We will go on ahead and move two points. This will take him down to two. He'll move four, two, and four. Has a range of four, so he can hit me. That is 10 points, and I only have seven, so I do lose another point of damage. One, three, five. Okay, this guy takes one damage. We're actually gonna move right. We're not gonna move. We're just gonna have to take the extra point of damage because they have 10 points, we only have seven. It takes us down to three. Two, four, six. This guy is eliminated. And we're going to go on ahead and we're just going to move right into him because it cannot hit me. I have six. It has a five attack. As long as I can keep this up. Four to hit. It need, I have a six. It has a five. One, three, three. I'm going to take another point of damage. I'm going to have to heal up no matter what. One, six, four, and he's eliminated. Okay, we bring it back down, and again, we flip over. And here we have level three. We're going to go on ahead and heal up. There is only one creature this time with, with five. Three. So this chap, what we want to be able to do is we have to have good rolls to hit. And good rolls. Four, four, five. So that would be, he would be able to hit me. I'm going to go on ahead and move this way. Nope, just right here. He'll move for two. I'm sorry, move for three. Five, five, two. I wish I had a range of three. I'd actually move him in and hit him. No, I can't. I am just going to sit right here. He'll move for three. And cannot hit me because his range is only two. One, one, six. I'll let him move there. He'll try and attack and cannot hit me. Okay, so we're gonna move three and two. He'll move even, odd, two that way. Bummer. I should have taken the point of damage. We'll move here. He's going to move here. He does not hit me because I have eight. So I will move three to here. 
He'll move here, cannot hit me. Three, four, six. I'm just going to sit and let him come to me. He'll move this way, cannot hit me. I will move here, he'll move here. Five, five, four. So I have, I don't even have enough defense. And I don't have anything to hit. So I will back up by one. I'll back up by two, excuse me, because he'll move three. I will go ahead and move my three. He will also move three. I am going to move two and four. He'll move three. Two, six, five. So I'm going to come down here and we're going to trade punches. And that's exactly what I was afraid of. So I'm going to, I have five for movement. I'm going to move two and three is five. He will move his three. Even odd. I will move here, he'll move here. There we go. Okay, so I am gonna go ahead and move down one, and we're going to again trade blows. So we're gonna go ahead and move our five. He'll move three. And we will again trade blows. By the way, this would not, this is gonna work after this level. We're gonna trade blows again. As long as I can roll a six, and I can't, I am gonna go on ahead and... Oh no. Oh no. Okay. I'm gonna move two. And, oh, and five. Whew. He'll move three. And I will move three. He'll move three. No, actually, he'd probably follow me. I'll move three, he'll move three. There we go, there we go. Two, three, and a six. We move here, and he's out. And we move to level four.
Level four is a tough one because it's all, it's the five level. So we are going to heal to six. Now the problem is I have to move in and engage. I can't run away unless I run behind a wall. But he has a movement of five and regardless of what I roll, I am not. He'll move three and two. The reason I don't move is because he, he, is, he doesn't have a range of six so he can't hit me. Six, five, three. We're just gonna move right into here. We are protected, he cannot hit. He's not gonna move, he's just going to attack and we manage to defend. We'll move here. We manage to defend. And we don't get to. Five, three. We are going to move here. We will attack. He goes down to four. We have enough defense. And this is where I was worried about. So we're going to go on ahead and three. Oh. That's not gonna help us. Uh, yes, it does help us because he still has to move up to get line of sight. He does do one damage to us. One, two, and a five. Where he's not gonna be able to hit us, we're just gonna stand, trade blows, nobody hits. Two, four, six, good. He's down to three. And cannot hit. 166, we're gonna stand right there and trade our blows. He gets down to two and he cannot hit me. One, four, five. Again, the same thing is going to happen. He cannot hit me. And there's down to one. And he's out. So We've, this is one cycle through the card. We then restart the card. Back to level one with the two hit points. But this time we're on level five. So we need to find all of our level fives. And we discover that there are three of them. When they hit, they can hit for 12 points of damage. I am going to keep my five. I am going to increase defense by one. And let's go. Okay, so we're going to move. No, we're not. Two, four, hold on. Two, four, six. And we're going to cause one damage right here. It's going to attack us and it cannot. They have a movement of five. Three and two. Two and four. So we will attack and it's out. We will move here. This will move here. No, we're not going to move. Okay, so they're going to do. So 
fill hands. So if I moved here, there we go, even, odd, three, and that's it. Oh, this one would move here. So he is within range, but he cannot hit me. Two, four, five. This is down to one. And we're going to stay right there. And this guy would probably... go around. Ooh, five, five, five. Nice. He's out. And we're just going to stay right there. He'll have to move one forward so he can attack. Can't hit me. <sighs> so if you're playing by yourself, what you can do is you can go on ahead and use one of the attributes. I, I, I probably said I wasn't gonna do it, but okay, I'm not gonna do it. We're just gonna take the damage at four. We're gonna sit here and trade blows. Nothing's gonna happen. Again, we're going to trade blows. Nothing is going to happen. There we go. This goes down to one. And he's out. So we're at four hit points. And we flip over to level six. And we have... One, one, three, two. So level six is four, five, four, four. They have three hit points. And I believe there are three of them. Hmm. They'll have a combined of 15. I am going to give this a whirl and we're going to go for more defense. And the reason I go for defense is it's always there. And that's that's why I kind of like that there. Two, three, four. We're not going to do anything. Yeah, we're not going to do anything. So they are going to move four, two, four, four. Two, four. One, three, six. This will be good. We will move forward. He's down to two. This chap will move here. And this guy will move two, four. I blame the Imperial. Oh. Kind of playing the imperial rule here. That whatever benefits the empire the best is what happens. So we're not going to move. Yes, we are. I'd rather be trapped in there. We have a defense of six. He'll move here. They'll move here. And four. So that gives an attack of ten. That's still only one damage. Oh, this is gonna be close. Okay, three, six, five.
10. They're going to do one point of damage to me. We're going to do this one. And there's a method to this here. 255. Five. This is down to one. I am down to one. Okay, good. 366. Six. We have enough. This is actually going to work out. So this one's out. We're going, going to go on ahead and move here. We're going to move four. He'll move three. He'll move here. Two, four. Okay, two, five, five. This will be pretty quick. Takes one damage. He'll move here. And that's it. They will do one point of damage. I couldn't move fast enough. I should have stayed right here. Because even... No, because they would have done this. Yeah, okay. So that's the end of this. That's loss. I hope you've enjoyed this. And I hope that you like and subscribe. Take a look at the next video right here. And I hope that you have an absolutely great day.